never to be harmed again. None of these men will survive. much for the commander. He may be carrying important information. Ah, this may tell me what their plan is. <laughs> <laughs> Dark skin, light step, brooding. You must be the C1 Felix raved about. It takes a lot to impress that one. You must be good. But let's not do awkward introductions. I prefer to get straight to business. And your reputation precedes you. If you've come to bleed for gain and glory, Siren welcomes you with open arms.
Yet many Egyptians in Cyrene. You'll get no judgment from the mouse, but you did stick out. The mouse? An odd title, my friend. Yes, yes, I am the mouse because I can access the more hard-to-find trinkets. If you follow me to my shop, I'll show you. Ah, bows, blades, scepters, you won't be disappointed. The mouse guarantees it. Sir... Bayek. All right. Let's see what you have, mouse. Don't you have trouble with the Romans? Well, you know what they say about our Latin friends? The Greeks invented the threesome, and the Romans added women. <laughs> Besides, I know how to stay hidden, Sir Bayek. With the way I look, I have to. People think the mouse is unlucky. They don't see I am an entrepreneur and savior of the way. Roman swine must have taken my chest to the barracks. Please, will you recover it? And why would I do that? Because you know what it's like to be brushed aside, victimized by those who hold themselves above you. The mouse will die on the streets with no living to support him. And what of the children? Will no one think of the children? And I could probably spare a fine reward for my savior. I would not want the children on my conscience. God bless you, Sir Bayek. I will wait for you in the market behind the baths. Good luck, my friend. Bayek! I must be careful now. is dash. Now is the Evi! A double was in consummation!
I've saved my life for a second time, Sir Bayek. I am blessed, blessed by the gods who brought you to me on this, the greatest of days. The mouse will embrace you as a sign of my undying gratitude. Uh, please don't. Then money, I will shower you with riches to make Chris's jealous. Take care of yourself, mouse. Try not to get caught in any more traps, huh? Ah, such grace, such wit. You deserve more than mere money. Come see me again later. I will find you something special for my stash. Sir Bayek! Some black market merchant is trying to... Please. Are you a protector? If you have a moment. I am not a Philakitai. I am a Medjai. Oh, yes, of course. I should have noticed. These people don't understand. Our Roman friends do not take kindly to civil disobedience. Why are they protesting? They fear all is not well with our founder, the great Batos. The centurion locked his tomb. Some say he desecrated the dead in there left a scrawled note on the door and sauntered back to the Acropolis. Please, someone should investigate without alerting the Romans. And if that someone were to find anything, they could meet me here, and I'd be happy to help. <laughs> Greeks also treat their dead with great honor. And now, they suffer like Egyptians. The tomb's been ransacked. Romans were looking for something. Have the Romans no respect for the dead? Something is missing. Buried with these treasures. The bow and medallion are gone. 
The Romans are little more than tomb robbers. The Greeks are learning what it feels like to be Egyptian. Have your land, your dead, and your relics desecrated by an invading force. Empty. Drunk and stupid is a troublesome combination. Should not be seen in this area. Must be the bow of Batos. <laughs> Batos medallion. The priest will be glad to see the relics returned. Suspicions were well founded. The Romans took Bato's treasure. You have the relics? I do. They were not given the respect they were due. Those filthy desecrators. I will keep Bato's medallion safe. Legend says if it leaves the city, so will our fortunes. And Dibo? It longs to be in the service of Sarinaica again. Please, keep it. And maybe teach the Romans a lesson in honoring the dead. Huh. Gladly. The Founder sent you to us. Farewell, Magi.
I have my hands full with the magistrate Leander. I know he's corrupt, but his ties to Flavius put him above the law. Then let us sever those ties. Easier said than done. He's either threatened or bribed anyone who would stand against him. Simonides could help us if he wasn't such a drunkard. He was at Leander's villa last night and hasn't returned home. A good look for him. Excellent. Then I'll petition the other magistrates. Try the tavern or the brother southwest of the arena for our wayward friend. We'll meet back at my house. It's the only one with a large terrace on the main street. <laughs> That must be one of the carts. Are you Simonides? Oh, my head, why are you shouting? Diocles sent me to find you. Tell him I'm dead. We need your help with Leander. That demon is the one responsible for my befuddled mind and evacuating bowels. I'm sure someone spiked my wine. I'm sorry, but I have to take you with me. Bacchus and his nymphs be buggered. You, sir, are a fury sent to punish me. If I expire on the way, it's on your head. What is your name, torturer? Bayek. Egyptian? Yes. Diocles said you met with Leander last night. A party at his villa. Everything was flowing. Wine, women, boys. Sounds. Iphthos lost his toga. <laughs> Fun. Fun? Who? A, a mission. On a mission. Did you find anything? Oh. Only this? Are you all right? No. Curse you, son of Ra. Simonides, are you drunk? I won't ask where you found him, Bayek. On the street, some fool moved the brothel. Did you find anything at Leander's villa? Papers, records of bribes, treasury theft. His guards caught me before I could take them. I convinced them I was simply inebriated. A stretch, indeed, Simonides. So the evidence is there. I just need to take it. We would be forever in your debt. But why would you risk your life to help us? Because those who abuse their power should be removed, and the people freed from oppression, Egyptian or Greek. Ah, <laughs> well said. Our friend Bayek reminds me of Cicero. Uh, uh, the villa is east of here, surrounded by vineyards. We will gather the other magistrates at the Temple of Apollo. Find us there when you secure the evidence. Fortuna smile on you, my friend. Area is off limits.
Non terrate! Misturi nunc! Eti, fuoco! Se il sangue non... Orders to a slave. An expensive gun. from the people. No one seems happy. How long do we have to wait? Leander said to count by one to find the evidence. Oh. You don't you be counting? Diocles! It's a trap! Leander's attempting a coup! So, here you all are, plotting against me. You will answer to the people, Leander. My Roman friends will beg to do Quiet! We must protect the magistrates! Saved my life, my friend. Praxilla would not have forgiven me if I had let you fall at Neander's hand. 
Why would he do this? Was his lust for power so consuming that he would commit murder? I've seen men do worse for less. We are only alive thanks to you, Bayek. Cyrene deserved better than him at her helm. I know you will lead them well, Diocles. I wonder how Diocles is faring. I'm no actor, Simonides. Bayak, my friend. We were just talking about you. Ah, should I be worried? No, no. Simonides wants me to play myself in a comedy he's written about Leander, the laudable triumph of the luminaries of Cyrene. Ah, huh, catchy title. He'd be the first to admit it's drivel, but we're hoping a festival will restore some goodwill. To that end, I have one last favor to ask. No acting required. <laughs> Leander's villa should return back to the people. But without the deed, that's impossible. The Romans won't let us search Leander's office at the Acropolis. They will let me. I will find it. Oh. Mouse? They are going to kill me! Shut up! You're convicted of murder! They found the wrong man! I'm as innocent as a babe! Thank you, sir. Thank you, Sir Bayek. Get me out of this bloody cage! I'm hurt! real murderer out there. He's killing my friends. Slow down and tell me what happened, Mouse. I was at the bathhouse, meeting some associates, and suddenly a legion accosted me. Didn't you plead your innocence? They wouldn't listen. They accused me of killing Paulus Aurelius, the moneylender, gathered like a pig. Red hair in his fist, not my hair. I met with him, yes. But when I left the baths, he was very much alive. Drinking and whoring as usual. I am many things, but not a killer. It is all right, Mouse. I believe you. But the Romans will not believe a cripple and an Egyptian. Have faith. Stay low and wait for me at the gardens of the Temple of Zeus. There may still be clues to the real killer at the bathhouse. They are choosing your murder. I know Smintos is not the murderer, but I must discover who is. The Romans have closed off the baths. I should look for another way in.
So this is where he was murdered. This trigel has blood on it. Could be the murder weapon. The body has been moved. I need to find it. Red hair. But it is horse hair. Maybe from a wig. That is why Smintos was falsely accused. <clears throat> a scattering of beads. Someone broke their necklace. Did Paulus Aurelius struggle with a woman? A pin from a dress. Could the murderer be a woman? The murderer left a message. They will all pay for their crimes. Someone is seeking justice. stench of death and something else perfume what will you tell me Paulus Aurelius something is stuffed down his throat a knot hmm. I will cleanse Cyrene of the hedonists my next tragedy will strike down Cyrene's greatest agony Tragedy will strike down Cyrene's greatest actor, Metrobius. And it is signed Vesta. Vesta, Vesta. What is your problem with pleasure seekers? I need to find this actor before this murderer. Vesta targeting these men? Could she be a prostitute killing off her clients? I need to get rid of that lion before I can confirm my suspicions. But I think that is Vesta's second victim. Petrobius, <laughs> the murderer's second victim. There's not much left of him. Another note. Petrobius took his final bow. Only the horror of the He will die at the wolf's den. This Vesta has a flair for the dramatic. 
or as Wolf's Den must be the local brothel. Too late. Another note. This must be the horror. Father, we die. You will be quiet now, mother. By the gods, this Vesta is insane. That's it. Talk to me. And I will join you and father soon. Esther was not a prostitute, but the forgotten son of one. I hope the Duarte figures you out. I should return to Smintos. Of course you do. Don't worry. You are safe now. Bayek! Did you find the killer? Yes. The son of a prostitute. When his mother died, terrible grief overtook him. He believed a car would not let him rest until he found his father. He's dead? I am sorry, Mouse. He could not be reasoned with. I have his letters. The story they tell is a tragic one. Poor boy. Such sadness. What will you do? Won't the Romans be searching for you? I have a plan. A new life in Apollonia, where you can taste the sea it is so close. Find me there if you can, Sir Bayek. Good luck, Mouse. This is heavily guarded. to find the deed but hidden quarters. Fill up papers. The Oakleys will be happy. We can usher in a new era now. Hello, 
Ποιος πράξεις αλόγου ανθρώπου. Αφά παπέ! Αυγέ είναι η μωρά! Χέρι! The deed is yours, Diocles. The people had lost faith in us magistrates. This will restore a lot of it. You will win hearts and minds, Diocles, with actions. Vitruvius is a friend of yours, yes? A visiting merchant said he saw him on the road near the citadel, and he appeared to be in trouble. That architect is a good man. I've heard his public works have revitalized South Sarineca. I would love to meet him in person. Perhaps we can meet at the Oracle of Apollo. I will check on Vitruvius, that rare Roman dreamer. Vitruvius, Diocles told me you were attacked. On my way to the Citadel, some accursed marauders took my manuscript, my life's work, the architecture. These are dangerous times, but I would not take bandits for scholars. I dread to think what they'll do with it. Certainly not appreciate the function and form of the modern approach to architecture. Then I will get it back before they use it for kindling, or worse. 